New at 11, Cincinnati police are searching for whoever carried out a series of drive-by attacks with a paintball gun, this blinding a man in one eye. Yeah, nine on your side's John Genovese has the story. As he turned around, he got hit, boom, right in the eye. Belinda Holden Victorian's son Patrick was walking on the sidewalk after grabbing a slice of pizza at Goodfellas and over the Rhine. He didn't even know if he was shot or whatever, but then he realized it was a paintball because his eye was blue. Patrick fell to the ground. People nearby called paramedics, but Belinda got there first. The doctor's prognosis indicated that he lost his eye because when the paintball hit him, it blew up like a balloon. Patrick's attack was one of at least two similar last Thursday. We heard a quick series of pops. Fred Neuror was walking with colleagues after finishing up a youth mentoring event at Rheingeist Brewery. I felt pieces hitting me from the side opposite of where the shots were coming from, so I thought there were bullets hitting the wall and shrapnel hitting me. And my friend said, oh my God, my chest is burning, took off running. She's been dealing with bruising ever since. Neuror got a glimpse of the car as it was driving away. It was basically a four-door black compact car. It was older. Uh, the rims were dark as well. They were black as well. Uh, any windows I can see were blacked out. Cincinnati police confirmed to none on your side they are investigating. A quick thrill or something funny that they thought might be funny is going to cost somebody a lifetime of suffering and pain. On pain meds and with the possibility of having his left eye removed, Belinda hopes the people behind this pay the price. Who would do that? I mean, why would you just, you don't have nothing better else to do? John Genovese, 9 on your side.